gonna be dark very soon. Have just enough daylight. This place is utterly destroyed. Still waiting on these guys. In here, in town, I don't know. Um, they said they're about to be 45 minutes, so. And I'm just looking for a place to so, chill out at. This is nuts. Yeah, this is better than anything around me right now. Whoa. Holy shit. Oh, yeah. Wow. Oh, we got an elevator, too. Wow. Who needed to use the fucking two <laughs> right. the elevator? Okay. <laughs> I like these little pots in here. Look at this shit. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, yeah, look. I stuck a manic. Oh, it's, it's down now. What happened? Is that the one? I stuck, I stuck one up there so I could take a picture. Come That's on. creepy. Look at this floor. One of my favorite things is just how nature takes back over. That's what we're talking about. I mean, I'm all part of my thing. That's a real tree. <sighs> Growing inside of here. It's a pool, baby. Oh yeah, where's the diving board? Over there. Is the, is the book still there? No, this is the wrong one. Oh, cool. yeah, this is the uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> you gonna jump on that diving board? Do you trust that thing? This is my wild man. <laughs> Look at all these benches. Oops. <laughs> Abort. Sewer thing. Yeah. Because this place is so big. One light does not suffice. Look at the hallways. Just lockers and lockers. This is so nuts. <laughs> and you know what's funny? I was telling the people at that place I was just at, it's like the little things when you're doing this. It's like all of a sudden you like become interested in like uh, architecture and stuff. <laughs> it's like you don't really think about it until you're in an abandoned place and then the you just plaza, see the beauty in all of this. The Lee, the Lee Plaza is one of those places. The first time I went, I was so hammered. I'm pretty sure you say told you that I climbed out in a fucking ledge <laughs> and hung drunk off. as shit. <laughs> 
I got a buddy who just went out to Chicago and they climbed like a 32 story sky skyscraper and did the same shit and that was cringy to watch. It was, dude, I may have been drunk, but this shit was still scary, dude. <laughs> <laughs> it was scary, I just had the drunk balls to do it. So, I mean, this is as far, because there's an exit, so this is as far this way. So the school is all the way that way, and it is massive. Okay. And the The main point that we are looking for is all the way on the other end, is the auditorium. Let's do it. I gotta take a piss. Yeah, I don't like the auditorium, I, dude. Did you still got all I the mean, I just used the bathroom around with me. Exactly. Yeah. Look at this. I think I'll be in here. <laughs> there are on here. But that's the cool part about exploring is you just really get to, you really just your mind just goes wild and you can just it's like you can almost like foresee all the kids that were running up and down this aisle. Yeah. All the teachers that were spanking Back their in butts. The early 80s, dude, it's gonna start, <laughs> yeah. Well it's like Jason was, he's like my pictures aren't thinking. I'm like, you're capturing the building how you're capturing, man. Yeah. For the past couple of days, and uh, he drove up just outside of Chicago. So, pretty lucky to have him with us here today. I'm going to show him around. Five hour guys, five hour drive, guys. Yeah. And it was for you. Because I care about you, and I care about these guys right here. <laughs> yeah, his people. He's got people on his, uh, his channel, so we're going to give some good footage to take back to home. Look at that. This is, this is incredible, though. I like all the helmets around. There must be like a roller rink. Last couple of years, I feel like it was more destroyed now. Than I got a picture of it. So this is the... This there, is there what it is. What am I thinking about the location? Luke, that's what I was talking about. The spiral staircase. It spiral goes down. staircase, eh? Oh, that is cool. <laughs> I don't know how far it goes down, but I know it has to go up for at least two, two stories. I think it might just be one. That's an okay. I'll try with the one. I don't remember the last That one. just must be like a water heater room and stuff. Probably. And now I'm exploring with Josh. Yep, down there is a water heating room. Even though there's no water or no heater. <laughs> That's what that is, though. I want to go together with cool and keep that. You don't want to Yeah, you could that, the for the, uh, that was the whole thing. Oh. Pool heaters down here? Jeez. And look at the old, like, the brickwork and stuff. If I saw correctly, this place was, like, 1937 outside. I think so. I think so. Don't, don't quote me on that. No, don't quote me either. <laughs> I do have it on film, I think. What? A... There's so many plastic spoons down there. Look down here, man. <laughs> Is that a bear? I'm going to get it. <laughs> you cut your shit. Is that a bear? <laughs> bear! He dives in head first. I thought there would be water. <laughs> Court? Did you find it? What'd you find? They have a mini courtroom. Oh, why do they have a mini courtroom at a school? Yeah, um, to get people ready for attorney at law or whatever. Okay. Junior college. Yeah, dude, like, in the early 2000s, dude, like, 15,000 people moved out of Detroit, dude, and, like, huh. the population for the school just dropped. It was right there, here. <clears throat> oh, this is so cool. We got a little mini courtroom here in this college, this pre-college? Junior. Junior! It's a junior college, something I didn't go to. Yeah, me neither. <laughs> <laughs> we got all these seats. Got a piano in here for some reason. <laughs> Judge Mathis was here. <laughs> Watch that shit. <laughs> oh. Here's the bench for trial. Never seen that before. Check this out. This courtroom has these, yeah, has these little tables that pop right up in the seat. Look at that. That's crazy. Oh, no, never mind. You're vaping. <laughs> <laughs> like someone.
What's going on in here? Something's burning. Something smells like Slurpee. <laughs> <laughs> Something. <laughs> yeah. Something. No, well, it's not something you see in my area. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah. It goes off for me. That's <laughs> weak. I do not remember that. It's gotta be new. JFAC, man. Job for a cowboy. <laughs> Dude, me and him do hear some weird stuff in some of these buildings, bro. A vending machine? Bruh. <coughs> they ripped the coin box out and everything. <coughs> That's the asbestos working its magic in your lungs. I work in a foundry. <laughs> My pan to the halt. Whoa! What the heck is this? Tong to tong tong tongs. This is very cool. Yo, HD meter. Where's the if meter? I had to guess, I'd say that they were sterilizing oh. medical supplies. Part of the junior college. Yeah? Oh, you know way. Huh. No, this is so cool. Look at the date on this. 1980. Wow. I have no clue what it is, though. No clue what that is. <laughs> Some sort of electroshock thing, it looks like. Yeah. I want to take this to the trip, dude, and have him make something out of it. Yeah, there's a chemical <laughs> book here. That's cool. Mm hmm. Oh, there we go. Speakers. I got stitches that's in the backpack. I can't say that word. Oh. Things that check your heartbeat. Yeah. Oh, the heartbeat checkers. <laughs> the music, the music room. Can we go to the music room? It's in the other building. You know what's incredible is no, like I it was in this one. Yeah, that this on, uh, this is still intact. Like no one's broken it. Yeah. And the goggles. A lot of the stuff in here. And all the speakers like over there. Oh, wow, I didn't see those. So this is yes, definitely a chemistry room or some sort of something like that. Last rod. <laughs> I'm sure it's not a thermometer? No, look, there's a bunch, there's a ton of them oh. there. Oh, wow. I think they just use this to stir stuff. There's a whole, there's a whole, there's a whole, there's a whole lot of them. Look, there's little tubes. Oh. So crazy. <laughs> oh. The world's biggest crack pipe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, surprise these Sorry. are still in here, right? <laughs> I had to say it to you. It had to be done. There's littler ones right here that are hollow. Oh, come on. Test papers. Blue litmus paper. Oh, wow. Keep away from light as I'm shining a ginormous light on it. What is that? Is that a refrigerator? It's a precision telco. <laughs> <laughs> the scientific company. I think it was used for... <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I think they exploded things in there. <laughs> oh. That's where they exploded things. Exploded. <laughs> exploded. With an A. <laughs> this is cool. The world's smallest bomb. <laughs> Uh, you want to see a beaker room? <laughs> this is a goddamn beaker room. I'm gonna slip it in here a little bit better. 
God, see the thing is like there's so much to film. Oh my gosh. Look at all these bottles oh, wow. and beakers and beakers and beakers and beakers on beakers. On beakers on beakers. On oh, beakers. Okay. No, no, you're good. You're good. I was about to do the same thing as you. Sometimes you gotta do it. Well, we know the roof is leaking a little bit. Yeah, and Dustin usually sends me in first. <laughs> That's what you're here for. Make, your, right, make yourself useful. <laughs> oh, you know where this brings us to? Right where we just were. Really? Yeah. Stickle. Oh, it is. Whoa. Right part of the junior college. So they got the little court offices, and now they have. Little medical rooms. They like came in Beaumont already. Cotton swing. <laughs> Beyond creepy footsteps. Yeah, you, you, know, you know, it's weird. It's like a lot of the. <laughs> it's cool because I feel like all the YouTube videos I watch, everyone's like, their everything's already been staged because they've been gone to so many times. This doesn't look like it's really been explored by many people. Oh. Like a lot of locals. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I edited it out. No. It feels like it's just like a clean towel for like a patient. Yeah, it is. Oh. It is one of them. He's got SARS. Give him this. <laughs> Don't give him our good shit. Those be them blood towels. I've had those on me a couple times. No fumar. For disposable balls swab with different. Oh my god, look, it's a male external catheter. Ugh. It sounds like it hurts. Okay, this is a uh, Look, you put it on the pee pee. Look at the instructions, you can see it going on the pee pee. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> oh, it's an external catheter. Yeah. I might need that one day. It Mom. goes on top of your pee pee and you can pee in it. Dude, this would be really cool if you had like a really long flight somewhere. Or like a stadium. Like, like Or like a five hour morning. drive home. Yeah, but <laughs> <laughs> Some old lunch trays. Those are plastic ones. I'm not impressed. Literally untouched since this, the day this place like just no more. <laughs> since this day, place no more. I'm tired. I need an energy drink. I got a monster. I do like how well. I like that this place is really boarded off though, so we can film. Yeah, we're standing there. Would have been one of the gyms. This was a gym? Yeah, I, I guess this is what happens. It caught on fire. So they re redid it to this, and this is part of the junior college. Okay, so it's like a nice like like lobby. Almost. Yeah. So you got one pool there, and I guess there's another pool right underneath us. Oh. That they did they stopped using because when the gym burnt, it collapsed straight into the pool. Oh. And then is the original story to this building is it's uh, it's two schools in one. One was a boys, one was a girls back in the day. Gotcha. So they eventually combined them all the two. Gym class got, you know, boys and girls. Swim class, boys and girls. So they just shut the one down. Hmm. Uh, keep moving forward. Keep moving forward. Look at this. Look at these. Look at these. Kind of creepy. Fall on bookshelf. 
Oh. Oh, that is a pretty diamond. Shine bright like a diamond. This is a, a giant art piece of rebar that is 3D shaped to be a diamond. This is pretty impressive. And there's definitely a fire that happened in this room. As you can see, I'm just stepping on tons and tons of ashes. Tons and tons of ashes. You produced the best part of any abandoned school. Oh. You purchased it. Yes! <laughs> it's the auditorium. In my opinion, this is one of the best that you can have done for Cooley was burned down, unfortunately. This is awesome. It's huge! Balls! Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. And there's some sort of character set on it. Let's drop it. Marches, baby. Gotta have the marches. So cool. Lower level of all the bleachers. You can see the seats down here on the floor. It's a trunk case for equipment. Oh my fuck. This is the coolest thing. Look at this. Gosh darn beautiful. Okay. This is oh wonderful. It says jump. Don't test me. <laughs> Hold my beer.
handed. I trust it. Doing this for you, because I'm sure you want me to go in there. So here I go. Okay. This is Henry Nelson. Clemay. Cla May A G I don't know what that says, but it does say one P or it's a backwards nineteen thirty-four. This could be very, very original. I think this is when it was built. I think it was built in nineteen thirty-two. So that it's two years after this place was built. That's pretty cool. We're getting out of here now. Wipe from top to the left. My camera's not gonna pick any of this up, but my camera barely picks the it up. City. That's because I have a fucking phone. <laughs> but we found rooftop access, but we're definitely not gonna go. I'm gonna shine the light on this part though, real quick. <laughs> Right here, yeah. just so you can get an idea of how this place looks. No, I still can't see anything. No, right. Uh, right. <laughs> yeah. Whoa! There we go. This is a three-story gym. Nice. The top part is a track. Yeah. Wow. Oh, the kickball. Now we're at the upper level of the gym. Yep. And this is a, wow. What the? It's a track thing. As I said, I wish I brought my skateboard again. That is an old school. They don't make tracks like this. <laughs> no. So what you're not seeing in this video is that this is actually curved like a like a racetrack, like Indy 500. <laughs> it's actually curved. <laughs> yeah. You can really fly. <laughs> exactly, that's crazy. All signs come down. Yeah, be careful about that. There's one, uh, I think it was Kettering. There's a school down, down there. Not it's, down here, but down in it's crazy how things. It's crazy how things just shift so much when, you know, water absorbing and. Getting hot and cold. And then the padlocks. <laughs> yeah, HPCA. The, the first building that me and him went to together was uh, Northview's a mental hospital. That's a good one. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> I got it though. <laughs> yeah. Uh, they probably sealed it up like they did that other pool room. I'm sure it wouldn't be hard to notice. See how it's all fucking sealed up? I think that's it. Cemented across. I don't know. Only one way. Dude, look at this ginormous thing. This is for like. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is the biggest air conditioning unit I've ever seen. And that just blows a lot of air. That blows more air than my ex-girlfriend. 
Shit, that's huge. Look at that wheel. And these are all the water heaters. Oh my gosh, yo. Good call, because that almost just happened. Uh, it looks like someone was just hanging out in here. Yeah, I know. I almost stepped in it. Oh, that stuff's about to cave in. Okay. Oh, I got doo doo water on my neck. Ooh. Right. Wow, we're in a tunnel system right now. We are 100% submerged. There's the copper has gone out of these ones. That's the big wire right there. That goes far back. Hey. Is that your four loco too? No. That is kind of new though. Look at it. Yeah. That's Dustin. Uh, do I think, think this is the way to the follow children? I would. Or to the hospital? It might be. They're supposed to connect. Well, I think this would be it. <laughs> if you guys didn't find it and you didn't try that, that could be we it. We didn't try that. I remember getting pictures of them from over here down this way. If you guys want to give that a shot, I'm down. Oh, oh, oh wait, the last time we went through a tunnel like this, my legs hurt like, for like three days and it was only for like a hundred feet. I feel so this is new, Jason. Oh, sorry, man. Oh, I'm good. Oh, so they can close it? I feel so they were trying to get something out of the wall. <clears throat> I'm gonna really stripped all the wire out of here because these are these are what enclosed the wire right here. What Dustin read about mine. Right? Um, yeah, yeah, that's, you're right. What Dustin read online is that uh, maybe the city the took it. The started taking stuff out of here before the. Yeah, that was the hospital. Oh, it was the hospital? Yeah, they, they went, it, it shut the school down. Yeah. And they cut the phone lines. And they heard the, the people on meat or whatever. So they called the police and said, from the scrappers or whatever, was it somebody from the hospital or the school? I don't know. And one of them, they had stayed here and fucking held the people until the police showed. And that was in like the late 80s, early 90s. Huh. I think, right? Or late 90s? Early 2000s? One, oh, somewhere yeah. around, along that, right? Something along that lines, man. Uh, every time he finds a building, he looks something up on it, he has a very good You can get up there though. Yeah. Not much up there though. Steam <laughs> Boiler room. I'm authorized, no worries. <laughs> Ooh. Yes. No. <laughs> Dude, I think that tunnel we found could be it though. I don't have a good I don't have the best back in the world though. So when did this place close? Because this has a 2009 calendar. I, I oh, there's a 2010 calendar. Yeah, I think I want to see 2011. Yeah, was it somewhere in there? A lot of the schools sort of closed down around two, in the 2010s. Too. I knew all the ins and outs of this place, but it's been a couple months. You know what I mean? Mm hmm And I just didn't do any more research on it again. Since July, I think, right? So if I didn't mention already, this right here is Dustin. I just met him today. You can check out his YouTube videos. He does a lot of urban explorations. Out here in Detroit and other places, you can check them out at Wasteland Explorer. Did I say that right? Yeah, Wasteland Explorer. I Waste saved myself, man. It's late for me, too. Wasteland Explorer. We still got hours more. Wasteland Explorer, obviously, I'll have a link to his channel down below as well. Awesome. It was really cool of him to meet up with me. I actually just messaged him out of the blue. What I did was I, I searched Abandoned Detroit on YouTube, and then I categorized it from most recently posted, and I contacted about five to six people on YouTube, and he was the only one to respond and actually agreed to show me around. So this was super cool of him. Yeah, <laughs> awesome, man. I'm so glad you came out. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I thought, someone new. I thought it was like the craziest thing. I was like, dude, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to 
looks for most recent, assuming that one of them might live in that area, and just message them all. Yeah. <laughs> Well, that's cool that mine came up as most recent. Yeah. Bullets in your ass! This is... This is kind of getting creepier as we keep going. Yeah, we really don't do too much night exploring. The last time we did... Dude, but that's the best time to do it! It was the Great Detroit Hospital. We went in when it was night time and shit. I think... This looks like it's headed towards a pool. Yeah. It's more you smell chlorine? I love the chlorine. Yeah, Jason's got a bunch of shitty uh, allergic reactions. Alert allergies. Hmm. Like it's not being allergic to spice rum. Yeah, no, I'm allergic to spice rum and chlorine. That's it. Fun big one. <laughs> I just can't go swimming in the pool and I can't drink a rum coat. <laughs> well, is this a pool, Eric? Is this a pool? Yeah. I found it! <laughs> The, that was all me. Is the book still on the diving board? Awesome. Is this the pool that burned down, or does that mean there's yep, yep, three? So above it, above it, it burned down. Oh, so where's that closed entrance that we saw? Can't okay. see much. So here, here we are. Uh, you want to read the book? No. <laughs> sure. There's a the cement lock window, so we were just on the other side of that. Oh, okay. Hmm. So just on the other side, that's the other pool. Very cool. Is this how they figure out how the college students are in what they're doing when they grow up? Mechanic. Astronaut. <laughs> oh, I got a writer. <laughs> well, well. That's, that's kind of shitty. Oh, look. We got this Boeing out now. That's cool. The one dude came here last year and he said this place is falling to shit. Oh, wow. I'm about to knock this whole wall over just by doing this. That was rooftop. <laughs> He's destroying stuff. Yeah, such a bad guy. Ooh, that's sketchy, my dude. That's where I got a picture of me reading that book. That's sketchy, my dude. <laughs> That's as crazy as I get. So now we're going into the building lab. And that's how you totally ass backwards a video that you have to edit. <laughs> Man, a little welding. A little welding spots. I still like how everything's on the chalkboards. That's not even a chalkboard. But these are little welding spots here. Two, three, and station number four, number five, number six, number seven, number eight. We got a look like a press here. Spot where the uh, the metal material would lay. And then you got number nine. Number 10, 11, all your little welding booths with little curtains, fireproof curtains. Wasteland Explorer, showing me around Detroit. Wasteland Explorer, this is a badass name. <laughs> Wasteland Explorer, that's, that's a legit name. And then you got your boy Luke Alish over here. We do all sorts of videos, don't we? Apparently we have a car over here. Oh. So they would take this machine and flip the car any way they wanted to. Wow. So like, should I go sit in here like I'm flipped over? Sick. Well, when we were here last time, the car was, was upright, now it's upside down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's well, obviously they got it moving somewhere. Either they got it moving or, oh, I was actually, you know what I was going to say, the hydraulics gave out on it, but that would be opposite, because this would still be down. Yeah. Because that, yeah. Wait. Yeah. What kind of car is this? Some kind of Oldsmobile. This is cool. Like, everything's replaced on it, too. Like, wires, everything. Dude, this thing's mint condition. This thing was brand new. 
And they probably got uh, donated by a car company for doing the power. Yeah. So they used to do that for Royal Texan. Yeah, because this thing's brand spanking new. Like, look at the bottom of this. Yeah. There's not a speck of rust. Really? Yeah. Someone took out the cat out of this thing? Oh, yeah. The catalytic con Who would want the catalytic converter for this thing? Uh, it's Scrappers. Got, uh, Somebody got some. Yeah, but you could have got this muffler. Yeah. Welcome to Detroit, man. Hmm. They definitely solved that motherfucker off, dude. Yeah, they took the wires out of this thing, too. Most of them. Got some lazy scrappers around here, that's for sure. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this, is, this is so cool. Got the door paneling off. But this was actually used for, uh, it looked to me like this was used all for example, because usually this stuff is mounted to the door yeah. on the metal end, but they have this fiberglass, not fiberglass, but plexi, yeah, yeah, plexiglass yeah. cover that it's all mounted to. Like I said, it was probably donated, dude. Yeah. And they probably set it all up for, you know, yeah, like you're saying, like for kids to see how everything works and what was what. Yeah. And... Definitely no intention on putting it back on the road. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you guys gotta change your your air filter. It's looking a little dirty. <laughs> Let's check the oil on that bad boy, huh? There's a gas tank for it. That's pretty cool. Lighting system trainer. Hey, look at the battery. <laughs> now how you know this is from the 80s? Two really simple things. One, square headlights. Two, these are these used to be on the floor. For what? For the headlights? For uh, brights. Really? Oh, regular. Brights, regular. What they do is they put them, because I had a 1981 uh, Chevy K10 and it had this. Yeah. That's cool, man. And designs them. Okay, so. Dude, I bet you probably have to try to figure out a way to do the park the game. Because they never graduated. <laughs> Here's a remote for it. And another control. So this is a five axis. From what it means. Robot. As much as I know it is. Robotic thingamajing. Mm -hmm. Robotic thingamajing. And then this is. So that's what I think is the five axis. Oh yeah. This thing I don't I don't know at all. <laughs> that's cool. This, this is the kind of abandoned shit I came here to see. <laughs> this is sick. See, this is what my dad's company does, and I've I've grown up since a child building all these. You got your transformers, distribution blocks. Yeah. Well, this isn't a distribution block. This is a. Shut up, Luke. You know what you're doing. <laughs> Well, anyways, they're a pain in the ass to install sometimes, especially this one, to line up with this, which is the lever that locks it. So it's done, it can't open. It's cool. Yeah, I make them, then they ship them out, and then the guys in the field wire them up to stuff like this. It's pretty cool. I gotta show my dad this. Look at that. Well, I found our way in. This place has fire damage. I mean, I'm down to go look at it, but it's severe fire damage. Like, oh, I'm good, man. Nice motherfucker car. This is why I'm happy. Fingerprints on this. I don't know 
really think they're checking for fingerprints out here. That shit costs money. Nah, that shit costs money. But, uh, that sucks, man. These people had a daughter. Oh, they even tried setting it on fire. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, dumbass. This new car don't do that. Try to make it go boom, boom. <laughs> <laughs>